Arian Fenton. Thank you very much, Mr Speaker. Well, it is a pleasure to take a call on the summary offences position of handheld lasers amendment bill. And in saying and uh, in, in introducing in my introductory comments, I do want to con congratulate Dr Cam Calder for bringing the bill to the House. And I will be remaining on the Transport and Industrial Select Committee. And what's more, I'm going to be flying the flag for Labour in the transport portfolio, which is fantastic. I'm very excited about it. And I'm, I'm I'm sure we'll get round to talking about the Hamilton Expressway at some stage, Mr. Bennett. At some stage, <clears throat> I want to uh, start first of all by acknowledging uh, the pilots of these aircraft. You know the wonderful pilots who work for um, our wonderful national carrier called Air New Zealand. But um, they must be not only worrying about lasers at the moment, they're probably be also dreadfully worried about the government's plans to partially privatise or further privatise Air New Zealand. And probably that's <clears throat> a far greater risk to their sense of job security and safety than anything that uh, some larrikins may do with, with lasers. So as I say, I want to acknowledge them and acknowledge all the people, uh, the flight crew, that flow on Air New Zealand who are feeling uh, some uncertainty at this stage as this government progresses its uh, crazy asset sales program. Um, um, <coughs> it's, it's tempting to say, while I have congratulated Dr Kim Calder, it's tempting to say that I have to wonder why we're doing this on a Member's Day. Mm -hmm. I do, I really have to, because I've gone back, you know, the, in one of my previous uh, portfolios, I was the transport safety spokesperson. So this isn't something that's new. In 2010, um, someone said, Larrikins shining lasers into the cockpits of aircraft might need to experience the full penalties of the law to remind them of the seriousness of their actions. That was me. In 2010, I was calling, I was calling on the government, the government, the government to do something about it. Uh, in uh, February 2012, <coughs> someone else said, the unlawful targeting of aircraft by reckless laser users is endangering the safety of both pilots and trappers. Who said that? That was Ian Lees Galloway. Ian Lees Galloway. It was 2012 he was saying that. So this is, that's two years after I started this crusade about laser. Uh, you know, genuine concern. And so I'm... I'm really pleased that Dr Cam Calder has followed the lead of the Labour members on this side <coughs> who have been calling for something to be done about this and uh, we are very pleased to support the bill. Although, as I've said, um, I, I do believe it should be a government bill. The, go the, you know, the government really needs to not waste members' days on things that could do it itself. It could easily, easily put this into a transport bill, easily, or an omnibus bill. It could easily do that. And instead, we could be dealing with some, <coughs> some issues in this House that actually um, need to be addressed uh, by members who don't, uh, particularly on this side of the House, who don't get the opportunity to put forward um, government bills, uh, Mr Speaker. And so, you know, having made those comments, you know, and congratulated the member and uh, said, you know, he's done a good job in doing this, and we all know this is a growing problem. Uh, it's been growing since 2010, at least, at least. Um, uh, we know it's a growing problem, and it does need to be dealt with. And we are talking about people's lives, and it is a highly dangerous uh, situation. Uh, I do feel very concerned, however, that uh, the Minister of Transport has fobbed this off to a backbencher. Uh, he's fobbed it off to a backbencher to, to use up Members' Day. <laughs> use up mem <laughs> and David Bennett is now threatening me with, with a laser. He's now threatening me with a laser. <coughs> and forgive my, forgive my croaky voice, Mr Speaker, but I've got the, the loogie. Now, we do accept this is a serious issue. I am looking forward to discussing this in the Select Committee and seeing more demonstrations, <laughs> some more demonstrations, and I'm sure Dr Cam Corder, as I know him, the member really well, would have done his research and we'll have a variety of lasers, lasers to demonstrate to the Select Committee. But I also am looking forward to hearing uh, from the pilots and other members of the public, because it is a serious issue. It is highly dangerous. It's madness, actually, to be shining lasers in the lights 
of, on the eyes of pilots who are bringing aircraft into land or who are just flying over and above. It does put people's lives at risk. Um, so we'll support the bill. Uh, I look forward to some interesting discussion on the select committee, uh, Mr Speaker. And I just wish that the government was doing this rather than the member. But however, good on him for doing this. David Clendon. Oh, thank you, Mr Speaker. Uh, Mr Speaker, I'm pleased to take a...